It's a truism among cabinet makers that it's impossible to own too many clamps. The number of clamps required to make a knife is a lot smaller than the number required to make, say, a break front Chippendale china cabinet. But still, the principle still applies. The knife maker will use clamps every day in handle making, but there are a thousand other uses in the shop. There are a great many kind of clamps on the market, but the ones I get the most use out of are these welder's clamps. They're cheap, easy to use, and versatile. A close cousin to the welder's clamp are these little ratchet clamps. Again, simple, easy to use, handy. Next, we have the good old C-clamp. When you're assembling a billet for Damascus making, this will be your go-to clamp. They're slower than welder's clamps, but their jaws open wider and they can take more heat without getting rent. That's how we say ruined where I live, just in case you don't speak southern. If you've got something really big or something you really need to put a serious squeeze on, then you might want to turn to these cabinet makers bar clamps. There are a variety of bar clamps available, including these, from very small to very large. When I was first ramping up my shop, I'd buy a clamp or two every time I went to Home Depot. It only added a few bucks to my order so it didn't feel painful on my wallet. And before you know it, I had a nice collection that I could use for almost any project.